Hi, I'm Katie from Little Miss Meat Free, and today I'm making my simple sweet corn fritters. These are a really great simple meal option, especially if you've never cooked vegan food before. So, we're starting with 100 grams of plain white flour, and to that I'm going to add a tablespoon of baking powder. It seems like a lot, but you need it for the rice because it doesn't have eggs in. So that just goes into there. And to that I'm going to add a teaspoon of dried parsley and half a teaspoon of salt which just lifts the flavour. And you just want to stir that together until it's combined fully. Okay, now I'm going to add about 120 millilitres of cold water just to mix. And it becomes quite a smooth paste when you do this. And that's when you know you've got it right. Okay, and to that I'm just going to add a small tin of drained sweet corn. And this adds the base for the, for the fritters. And again, just stir that in and make sure that all the corn is, is coated evenly, as much as you can. So I've heated some sunflower oil, it's about four tablespoons in the pan. So I'm just going to put about a tablespoon each there for each fritter. Just goes in, you can probably get about three or four in the pan. You don't want to put too many in so they all join together unless you want a sweet corn cake. These are just small fritters, so they're going to go in there. And it's usually about two to three minutes on each side over a medium to high heat and you'll notice it start browning and crisping up. Just going to make a small tomato salsa to go with that, just to add a bit of extra flavour. So you want about five cherry tomatoes, just chopped, just quartered basically. Add a little bit of cucumber, just a small amount, just to add a bit of flavour and texture in that salsa. It's going in there. Okay, and some coriander, which I'm just going to tear it. I want it quite chunky so it's nice and flavoursome. Okay, and just a squeeze of lime to finish. I'm just going to give it a stir through and set aside for when the fritters are ready. Lovely, so that's two minutes on each side and I've got a lovely golden brown colour to them. So I'm just going to plate them up with a bit of salad and of course some of this lovely tomato salsa. Lovely, and a sprinkle of sea salt. And there you have it, sweet corn fritters.